Hello, this is Marl Brothers for Virginia Governor. I think everybody's waking up to the news that a bridge collapsed in Baltimore after a cargo ship hit it. Um, I believe this is 100% intentional. If the ship was having problems prior to it hitting the bridge, don't you think you would have stopped the ship just to do the repairs to make sure a catastrophe like that didn't happen? People, the ship supposedly from others who have got information gathered and said that the ship was going on and off with the lights and there was previous problems prior to it hitting the ship. I mean, hitting the um, bridge. This left me know a couple of things. It says, why didn't that ship call up to emergency personnel? And if it did, it's going to be some more explanations to shut down the bridge prior to that ship hitting it. You saying hours ago, that ship wasn't having problems? So it's a couple of things. Either this was a terrorist attack because I just can't see a ship that big heading the direction of the bridge. No one, it can't get past the bridge. And you trying to tell me sun foul hasn't happened? And now the bridge that got hit, a lot of truckers go over there, a lot of supplies, a lot of commerce. It sounds like somebody has shut down Baltimore. And this is not just some regular random thing. This is, appears to be a terrorist attack or some serious negligence. I can tell you like this, it ain't gonna just be my thoughts and prayers going on right now. It would make sure that anybody we can save right now in that water, we gonna save. Two, we gonna find out why that shipping company did not catch these red flags to prevent such a catastrophe. And three, people gonna be held accountable. Let that crap happen in Virginia and think people gonna be making excuses talking about the ship lights was going on and off. It made a hard right turn. I don't give a damn. People are dead right now because of negligence. Gross negligence. Failure to give a warning to let first responders ahead of you. No, shut down the bridge. We got an out of control ship. Why wasn't the ship stopped? when it started having problems so it didn't cause any more disasters. No, the ship just kept going and just going until it hits the bridge and now a bunch of people are dead. Nah, this appears intentional and there needs to be some answers because as I was governor, trust me, everybody in their mom would be down there asking for explanations because it would be a lot of interrogations and a lot of explanations to go on with what happened here. Because I wouldn't just be there's a little bit of investigation. I would be already there interrogating. Because somebody needs to explain this crap. And please, please people in the Maryland area, please let your families and friends know that you're okay and you're not on, it wasn't a part of this incident. There's a lot of people that's concerned out there. I would say thoughts and prayers. No, uh-uh. I'm saying, hey, this needs to be handled and accountability given because we can't bring those people back. We can't bring the people of the lives lost back. But we can damn sure get answers to the family. And then after that, once the family has closure, then I can say thoughts and prayers. But right now, families need answers. God bless you and God bless America.